Hi friends, today I am giving a lecture on inverse of a given function. Okay, so here let A and B are two finite sets. A function F mapping from A to B. So that means a function mapping from set A to set B. Then its inverse is denoted by F inverse mapping from B to A. So this F inverse from B to A is exist if and only if F is 1 to 1 and on to functions. Whenever the given function F is 1 to 1 and on to functions, then its inverse is exist. Okay. A function F from A to B, then its fun inverse function is denoted by F inverse mapping from B to A. So, these are the steps we have to follow for finding out the inverse of a given function. Next, example problem, find the inverse of the given function f of x is equal to root of x plus 4 minus 3. So, given that f of x is equal to root of x plus 4 minus 3. So, first step, replace f of x with y. So, now f of x is replaced with y. So, then y is equal to root of x plus 4 minus 3. Okay. First step, replace f of x with y. f of x is replaced with y is equal to root of x plus 4 minus 3. Okay. Second step, interchange x and y. We have to interchange x and y. So, whenever x is there, that can be replaced with y. Whenever y is there, that can be replaced with x. So, here y is there, y is replaced with x. That is equal to here x is there, x is replaced with y. y plus 4 minus 3. Okay. After that, solve for y. Okay. Now, third step, solving for y. So, then minus 3 can be go, goes to right hand side. So, that is x plus left hand side, sorry. x plus 3 is equal to root of y plus 4. Then, so squaring on both sides. Squaring on both sides. So, now x plus 3 whole square is equal to root of y plus 4 whole square. So, x plus 3 whole square is equal to a square plus 2ab plus b square is equal to y plus 4. Okay. Now, so this is x square plus 6x plus 9 is equal to y plus 4. Okay. Now, plus 4 can be taken into uh, left hand side. So, x square plus 6x plus 9 minus 4 that is equal to y. So, then x square plus 6x plus 5 is equal to y. So, therefore, uh, y is equal to x square plus 6x plus 5. So, after finding out the third step, y value, replace y with f inverse x. So, therefore, f inverse x is equal to x square plus 6x plus 5. So, therefore, f of x inverse is f inverse of x is equal to x square plus 6x plus 5. Okay. So, in this way, we have to find out the inverse of a given function. So, thank you. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please share this video to your friends and classmates. If you like this video, please subscribe my channel name. So, Divvela Srinivasarao. Thank you.